What's going on guys? Welcome back to Fallout 4. Now, as you can see, we're getting attacked by a rad roach because those things are wild. Anyways, where are we at right now? Okay, so this is where we came from, I'm pretty sure. Is this where we came from? No. Okay, this is where we're going. Okay. So, um, alright, so let's go over here. Um, if you guys haven't already seen the video where I do the Easter egg on that terminal over there, you should definitely check it out. But, um, as you can see, this is where the game basically starts because now we can kind of loot stuff and, uh... Can we use the toilet? Nope, not yet. <laughs> I'm looking forward to that, though. Anyways, drinking toilet water, at least. Anyways, let's go in here. Um, I want to do some looking around, even though it looks like everything is empty. Like, ev everyone just kind of evacuated really quickly, and the place has been taken over by rad roaches and electricity, which that looks kind of dangerous, so we're going to go around that. Wow. Okay, this guy's been dead for a long time. This is actually really weird. Oh, no. How do I block LT? Okay, hold on. Where'd he go? Okay. Wow, we can just one-hit these things. So, transfer... What is that? Okay, that's kind of to take it, which... I guess we can just press A. Okay. That's a nice little uh, new inventory thing there. Now, I want to go up to him and... Oh, so we can... We can examine stuff now. Okay, that's kind of interesting. Like, he talks about it now. Alright. That's weird, though. That guy's been dead for a while. Like, that's just... Like, bone. Unless these things, like, took his bones off or something. Alright, I can't hit him. I'm trying to, like, hit, glitch the system and, like, kill it while, you know, I'm glitched into the stairs, but I can't. All right, so let's open here. Wow. Okay. This place has been abandoned for a while. And we have some stim packs, too. Obviously, stim packs are... All that's left. Yeah. Um, obviously, they restore your health. There's a pistol just chilling here? That's kind of weird, actually. All right. Something happened here to where everyone died, but... I don't know. It looks like they had time to leave, but some of them died, so... Oh, man, this game looks so good so far. I've right, got another pistol here. Obviously, I'm going to take as many things as I can because of the fact that, you know, I have a pretty nice. big inventory. Coming back later for you. Oh, no way. Whoa. Look at that gun in there. Holy crap. Okay, we need a master. We need to be a master locksmith, though. I'm yeah. Uh, remind me to come back for that, guys. That gun looks crazy. <laughs> that looks like a lot of fun. So let's go ahead and pick up some of these stuff. Like I said before, I don't really know what any of this stuff is, you know, if it's even going to be useful. But might as well pick it up until my inventory gets full. So All right, that's everything over here. So what did he say about this door over here? Terminal. Oh, the, the terminal. Okay, so it's right here. It looks like our, uh, our boy here that ran the ter terminal died a little bit. I don't know. Something happened to him. So here we go, guys. So we have the Vol 101. 111. I keep saying 101. I'm probably going to say that many times, but 101 Overseer Instructions. All right. We've got the Cryolator, Operations Protocol Manual, Overseer's Log, and Open Evacuation Tunnel. Now, I would read through this stuff if I wasn't, um, you know, recording, but since I am, I don't want to sit here and, you know, have you guys read that. Now, if you want to pause it on that, you, you guys go ahead and, you know, you can. But uh, me personally, I'm just going to kind of go on and uh, move on with the, the game here. So. All right. Wow, we have a lot of bullets, too. Okay, let's see if we can... Oh, wow. Okay, my aim is bad. Oh, that sounds so satisfying, though. Okay, vats. Oh, our first look at vats. There it is. New and improved. Now, this is one of the things that I heard a lot of people actually didn't like about Fallout 3. Like, that's kind of like what deterred a lot of the new players. But me, personally, it's just like... It's a bonus thing. Like, it's not something you have to use. Like, look, I can easily pop some caps into this these guys, which, honestly, it's kind of fun just to shoot them normally like look at this this is a lot more satisfying like than it was in fallout 3 okay there's a lot of these things and i'm missing a lot of shots <laughs> all right there we go let's move on wow okay reload gun we already did in we go whoa this place looks crazy like this doesn't look like the uh fallout 3 vaults that's for sure because of the fact that all right you know at least some of the vaults because this is like this is a lot more like enclosed oh my god Everybody died. That's so weird. Um, I want to see what's back here because... Oh, wait. I guess that just leads over there. I don't know. I, I want to do some exploring, but I don't want to waste you guys' time. So, let's just go ahead and hop in here. Oh, a pit boy. You cannot use while in combat. Come on, you stupid rad road. Leave me alone. All right. And on to the pit boy. Oh, man. It's beautiful. I have two of these coming tomorrow, which, I'll, like I said, I'll do a video on that when they, when they get here. Man, if only the one that I ordered looked like that. Like, that would be so cool. Honestly, it would, but from what I heard, it's, it doesn't really look that nice. Oh, my God. This is so cool. Okay. Holo, holo tape found. Okay. Our boy has some trimmed uh, some trimmed nails there for someone who's been, you know, in cryo this entire time, which I guess they don't really grow when you're in there. But All right. So, we have our stats. 
We have our weapon, which we have two of these, along with our apparel. And we still have our wedding ring. That's kind of sad after seeing what happened there. Um, we've got the Red Menace, which is the game that we actually had. Like I told you guys, if you've seen the Easter egg video, you can actually play that at any time you want, um, you know, once you actually unlock it and beat it. And then we have the data workshops, map, and radio. So, pretty interesting stuff, though. Let's go ahead and open the vault, though, and uh, hop on out of here. Oh, so you can actually... Is this how you hack stuff now, using the... Uh Oh, so I, oh, that's the only way of opening it. Okay, interesting. So here we go, guys. Out into the real world. Here we go. I, I, it's just, I wonder what happened here, because we saw the raiders come in, and, you know, obviously they killed our wife, but they, they didn't kill these people, too, because obviously these people have been dead for a long time, and they seemed like they were looking for that baby, like they knew babies were, like, in these places. I don't know, it's kind of weird. I also kind of wonder why we didn't rescue those other people that were in there, you know? Because, unless they were dead, I don't know. But if they were just, like, in cryostasis, we probably should have rescued them and not just left. Oh my god, this game, beautiful. Alright, come on, give me up, give me up, I want to go. Oh, it's so nice looking. Here we go, guys. This is where the game officially starts. I hear something coming. It's not like a rad roach, but I don't see anything, so whatever. All right, up the elevator we go. Oh, no, up the elevator. All right, let me in. <laughs> there we go. All right, um, we can change our names as special attributes, which I'm not going to do. Appearance, no, and exit the vault. So up we go. All right, time to see what the surface looks like now. Whoa. Okay, so those who reserved spots in Vault 111 had no idea they would be cryogenically frozen. In fact, almost every vault was actually a secret social experiment conducted by vault Tech. If you guys, you know, played Fallout 3, you guys already knew that, so. But that's interesting. They didn't even know they were going to be frozen, but they just kind of, like, went along with it. All right. I mean, whatever. Oh, my God. It's beautiful. Look at this. War never changes. Oh my god. <laughs> it's so nice looking. It's so nice. Alright, let's head on down. Wow, can we just kind of like jump down these... Yeah, I guess we can. Oh my gosh. It's crazy like when you saw how it was before this and now how it looks. It's just weird. I want to see something real quick though. Can I actually change my FOV? I want to see real quick if I can. Controls... Toggle POV, no. Display, crossfade, no. Oh, there we go. Nope, that's HUD, Pit Boy, and audio. Dang, so I actually can't. You can't change your FOV in this game? I mean, maybe I just didn't see it, but that would, that would kind of suck if you can't. I mean, it doesn't look bad how it is, though, honestly. So let's actually go back to our house because, yeah, he should be alive. There he is right there. All right, just like from the E3 trailer. Cool. Codsworth. How did he survive? It's really you. What happened? What happened to the world? Uh, well, sir. Well, besides our geranium still being the envy of Sanctuary Hills, I'm afraid things have been dreadfully dull around here. Things will be so much more exciting with you and Mrs. Beck. Oh, that's so sad. Um, they killed her. I mean, they, yeah, they killed her. Sir, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, I, I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers or checkers. <laughs> Did he just say a family activity? It's literally only me and him. Oh man, um, he's been kidnapped. John's been kidnapped, but I'm going to find him. I'm going to get my son back. It's worse than I thought. You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Oh, this robot. 200 years? Holy, okay. 200 years? What? 
Are you? A bit over 210, actually. So wow. That's crazy. Rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> that means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Aha, good one. Good one, robot. Good one. How has this robot survived this entire time? I'll, I'll just what? get food. Why not? Food? Y yeah, sure. I, I need a minute to think. Then I'll be right back. Wait, what is the difficulty of successfully pertains to what indicated by the color yellow, easy, orange, medium? So he was easy then. All right, let's, I guess, get food. How does he have food after 200? How did he survive the raiders and everything like this? What? All right. So, wow, look at the house now. 200 years later. That's crazy. Oh, where's the special book? So I can get a toy car or a baby rattle. Don't really need those. Oh my god. It's so cra crazy just seeing it like that. Take the board game, which I don't know what that does, but why not? Oh, what do you have? Oh, sugar bombs. The Red Menace? Whoa, what's that? All right. The Red Menace? Why, the Communists, of course. The Russians and the Chinese. Um, Codsworth, buddy. I don't want to call him an idiot, you know. He's a deadly problem. robot. I have an idea. Let's search the neighborhood together. After all, Mrs. and Young Sean, they're, they're my family, too. Codsworth. Are you sure you're holding up okay? I, I, hey, that bonus XP though. Sir, it's been just horrible. Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. Oh, that's so sad. I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed, but nothing gets out nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. <laughs> nothing. And don't get me started about the future. <laughs> yep, white people problems right here. All right, anyways, uh, stay with me. Stay with me yeah, bring him with us. Oh, I guess we can't bring him with us. Oh no. Then, oh, everything happens. This is going to be something really sad. Thank you, Cotsworth. You're, you're welcome. I don't want to know what's on the hollow tape. And I'm feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? The missus and young No, oh, my god. This guy actually thinks that they're missing. All right, you know what? Let's just do it. Lead the way. I guess he'll, he'll kind of show us, you know, what's happened. Wait, I want to see what this hollow tape is, though. So, where is it at? You figure being like data, maybe? Inventory. Here it is. Hi, honey. All right, time to see what this is. All right, speak already. Whoa. Listen, I, I don't think that John and I can tell you how great of a mother you are. But we're going to anyway. Isn't that right? You are kind and loving. <laughs> Funny. That's right. And Out of Bobby Pins. But everything we do, patience, no matter how hard, patience is the thing my mom used to say. Say goodbye, Sean. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Come on. <laughs> Bye, honey. We love you. Aw. That's so sad, man. It really is. I kind of wonder what happened to the kid, though. Whatever happened to him. And what is up with these creepy... Oh, it was Halloween. Yeah, that's right. Duh, I told you that. Like, come on, Cotsworth. 
Trifold American flag. All right. It's so interesting to like see all this stuff though. You just be like crushed and gone. Let's see what he has to say oh, now. Yeah, they're dead. I told you. <laughs> it's okay. Thanks for trying, Codsworth. You can't give up, sir. I like how he only searched like two houses and he's like, they're gone. Concord is nearby, and well, the people there have only shot me a few times. <laughs> Alright. Um Thanks. Thanks for your help. Codsworth. Good luck, sir. You'll find young Sean. I know you will. I shall remain here until oh. Alright, so apparently he's just kind of chill here for another 200 years for all I know. And, uh, I, I, I still don't know how that robot survived, but apparently it ha <laughs> it has. I'm having the hiccups here. So yeah, um, let's go ahead and, I don't, I don't even know where we're going. Let's see what our pit boy says here. So we can go to map, and that is the sanctuary. So we can fast travel, to select location, which that's where we started with. That's the vault, and then we have to get to Concord. So how do I... Market. I don't know how, but let's just kind of head there, I guess. I don't know where. Oh, okay. I see it on the map now. A little thing. Oh, crap. Okay, we're getting radiation. Now, one thing I always wanted in a fall game was some sort of creature in the water. I hope they added that in. Like, I hope there was something in that water trying to kill me. I don't know. It's so random, but I just I want that in a Fallout game. Wow. Look at this. Oh, this is from the trailer, too. Or the E3 game. Yeah, there's dog meat. Oh, my God. How do I... How do I get him? I need him in my life. Oh my god. Um, let's go. Oh, we just got dog meat. How awesome. Alright. That is cool. If this dog dies, I'm quitting the game forever. Knowing me, he's probably going to end up dying within the next hour. M most likely less than that, but hopefully we can keep him alive. So here's the upgrade station. As you can see, we don't really have anything to upgrade though, so let's just exit that. It looks like there's a lot of um, upgrades, though, so that's kind of cool. And then we have the workshop and a button that we can push to close the garage door. All right. Wow. All right. Um, I guess we'll grab this stuff. I don't... Most of the stuff, I don't know what it is. Like, I'm not going to grab the aluminum can because that's useless, but there's just so many new things in this game that you can take, like cigarette cartons or telephones toaster we can do the ham radio which i i'm sure there's somebody broadcasting but i don't want to find out who yet and then oh look tunnel snake or not tunnel did i just say tunnel snake i'm so dumb that's um the 13 colonies or whatever the thing yeah i remember that um cap stash who how's that a cat they it was just say on top all right that's not even question it and we've got a red rocket terminal let's see what's going on here so we've got business entries new equipment installed and safe storage Ooh, okay uh, first thing we want to just hide them with the others. We'll figure out a long-term solution better. So they hid some sort of safe? I don't know. I'm just like quick reading it, so I don't really know. And then we've got a chem... What is that noise? What the heck is that noise? Oh, no! Dog meat, are you okay? He's getting ganged up on out there. I got you, dog meat. I got you, bro. Wow, that was crazy. Where did those things even come from? Dog found something. All right. Let me see what he found. Let me out here. What would you find, dog? What is that? What the heck is that? First aid? Alright, thanks, dog. Thanks, man. And then, we, of course, we've got some mole rat. Are there more of them coming? Why is it playing that music? Never mind. Alright. Wow. Alright, so already this is off to a pretty good start. Uh, we got a cooking station. A lot of stations here. And then we've got a toothbrush and an ice cooler. That's uh, interesting. I know I'm kind of, like, exploring all of this stuff, but I just really want to, like, see it all. Like, it's just crazy to... To play it right now and then we've got a nuka cola machine which by the way starting tomorrow you can actually buy nuka cola from target or quantum a uh, new cola Qu quantum from target so i'm going to be going up there tomorrow and definitely picking that up but yeah so here it is oh my god it's so crazy all right come on dog meat let's go where's he at why is he just standing there come on what's he doing issue a command okay go head over there Stop issuing commands. Okay, so I want him to follow me. Though. I don't want him to leave him here all alone. But yeah, onward to our first city, it looks like. Oh, what is that? Whoa. Blood bug hatchling. Okay, that's uh, a little creepy. Okay, I'm trying not to use vats. Like, I know I could easily use vats, but I don't want to. Because, like, I just like, you know, not using it. It's pretty fun. All right. We've reached level two. So now we have a new perk. And we're in this beautiful town. 
And uh, I guess we're going to continue in the next episode. So if you guys want to see more, make sure you guys drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Peace.